What's up guys, it's Claudio from Visual Moto WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to accept crypto payments on our WordPress website or on our local stores using Cryptomus, okay? This is a, it is, is a top crypto payment gateway, okay? So we're gonna be using this one and learn how to integrate this one to our WordPress website in order to have our, for example, this pet shop, this example pet shop website, selling the products that can be paid using Bitcoin, for example, okay? So, before you can start, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button, like this video, and share this content with a friend of yours. You have no idea how much it helps us, and I'm sure you're gonna enjoy this guide, okay? So, let's get it started. But before, let's explain a little bit more about Cryptomus. Cryptomus is a... Um, very useful and a top payment gateway for cryptocurrency okay so low commission this is very very good okay it's the lowest commission it's quick it's, it's quick so you can receive your money you can withdraw your money your bitcoins your currency fast it is really important if you are a business owner and it's easy to integrate because it have plugins for big CMSs, for example, WordPress, Prest Shop, okay? So here is the services for business and solutions for personal, okay? And for business, you can accept the crypto directly on your local store using QR codes. This is really good. Imagine that you are selling in local store and a person prefer to pay in Bitcoin. Another good advantage is the fact that this it's completely anonymous you can create an account using telegram for example and another good part is the fact that if you receive a payment in bitcoin it automatically converts it for you if you want into usdt that is a more stable currency cryptocurrency so you will not have the variation of the money okay so here this is how it works let me show a little bit more one solution for many business okay so we have Telegram bots, online schools, gaming services, high-risk projects, e-commerce, and online services, okay? Here is the commission, here is the blockchains, and here is the e-commerce plugins that they have integrations for. So let's explore. We have PrestoShop, WooCommerce, OpenCart, and Y and W H. MCS okay so the one that we're gonna be using it's the WooCommerce already gonna be clicked right here to download it okay so here is the plugin I'm gonna install it on my WordPress later but let's get back to the home page and create the account so I'm gonna start by clicking into the connect button right here at the home but of course you can click into the upper right corner of the menu so here is the join option. We can join with email or phone number. And if you want, we can join using Tonekeeper, if you want, or using Telegram, if you prefer. So you can create an account anonymously, okay? I'm gonna be using my email and the password, okay? The account is already created, okay? So now I must need to confirm my email. So let me let me grab the code that I did receive it into my email. And here is my account, okay? Here is the referral program link. Here are the settings and the dashboard. There is the API documentation. We're going to explore this later. And we have right here the auto withdraw because I do not have access to this because and most complete the security settings. Okay, so they do care about our security. For example, they have the 2FA authentication method. So if you go to the security tab, you can set on to the to, to the 2FA. And you can enable the 2FA. I highly, I highly recommend that you do this, okay? It's really important for your account security. I'm gonna do this later, but let's continue. As you can check, in the case that you want to 
have your API key, for example, you most have the 2FA. So let's get this enabled right now. Set on. Take a moment to read this. They recommend Google Authenticator or other Authenticator. So we most enter with the code that goes to our Google Authenticator app and to our email, okay? We need to enter with two codes, two different codes, so we can enable the 2FA, okay? Once this is now enabled, okay? We can use another way, okay? For example, the SMS in the case that you want, but I think the, the Google Health, the Google Authenticator better. Now let's switch to the business and we're gonna generate our API key, okay? Confirm the 2FA Authenticator and most enter with the code right here. So here is my API key. Please do not share this with anyone. I'm just gonna show you this because this is a video tutorial. I'm gonna delete this and create a new one after. But copy this API code. We're gonna use this later too. So save it. So we're gonna need to now move to our WordPress dashboard and install the plugin that we just have downloaded into their homepage from the plugins list. We're gonna go to our WordPress dashboard, move to the left sidebar of menus, hover our mouse over plugins, click on add new. Once right here, we're gonna click into upload plugins, click into choose file. In my case, the plugin is on my downloads tab. I'm gonna download, this is the plugin, WooCommerce by Craptimus. Click on install now. The plugin was successfully installed. Click on activate plugin. And the plugin is currently active. Just a note, this is a new commerce plugin. So you must have WooCommerce plugin active in order to make it work. After click on activate plugin, it's gonna redirect you to the plugins list of your site. Click into config button so we can set it up and we can enable air or disable the Craptimus gateway. We want to enable this, okay? Now, payment API key, merchant UDD, how much commission does the client pay? Pay now button text, pay with Craptimus. So let's set it up part by part. First of all, payment API key. Now, after all the information set, let's go to dashboard, okay? Here is the dashboard. If you reveal the right, the left side of, your, of our screen into the bottom of the page, you have a new button, create merchant, okay? Click on it. First of all, we need to apply a merchant name, okay? Your store name, for example. In this case, it's gonna be Visual Moro Test Store. So, payment by link or API. I'm gonna need to choose the API. Connect API. First merchant created. All merchant related of your own, like invoice, reports, and settings can be accessed within the merchant profile. Got it. Here is the merchant profile, okay? Statistics, settings, auto convert, and commission. Let's go to the settings. API integration. Here is my merchant ID. Leave a request to grab the integration on your website. Got token to replenish your merchant. In two, three days. So we need to apply the website URL right here and the description. In this case, it's gonna be Visual Muro Store Test. It's gonna be the site description. We must submit our website to their system and attention, save the IPI key. It will be shown to only once. So you must save this, okay? Copy the key. Here is the correct API key for integration. So this is the one that we're gonna post right here. Here, this is our payment uh, our payment API key. What else we have right here? To dashboard. 
let's go to my merchants profile settings and here is all the information we need merchant id the commission it's set as zero so we are paying the commission we can set this to this tab right here for example one percent is the amount so let me post the merchant id right here how much the commission it's one percent pay with Craptimus. let's save the change now if you go to the payments tab into the woocommerce plugin you can move the Craptimus to be your preferred your primary payment gateway after doing this, click on save change and your shop is ready to receive payment from Crypto using Cryptomus. Simple, easy, fast and effective. Remember, all gonna be into your merchant account, okay? So the most important for us, that is the shop owners, is this part right here. And from here you have hist history, statistics, settings, that is the place where our information with display it okay all the information is right here we have the auto convert so if we do receive a payment into bitcoin we can we can set a zone to auto convert to usdt that is a more stable cryptocurrency okay and we have the commissions every single coin have their commissions okay so re reveal this part we can see the invoices and the transfer option from this dashboard as well simple easy and effective and it is I hope you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question and don't forget to check out the link into the description for the plugin so you can download, so you can create your account and start receiving payments using cryptocurrency, okay? And take your store to the future levels. And it is, I see you later, all the best!